Yo, everybody, what's up? It's your boy, Apple Funk, and I'm going to give you a quick three-minute or less breakdown on the Jack Dempsey cyclic. You got you on the go. You got things to do. You don't have a lot of time to be watching a long video, and that's where I come in. So we're going to go ahead, and I'm going to give you my personal breakdown on the Jack Dempsey cyclic. Some people want to say that the Jack Dempsey got his name because it's fighting ability like the old boxer champion right there, Jack Dempsey. In fact, they're not as aggressive as their name would lead them to be, in my opinion. I found that Jack Dempsey's are pretty chill. Um, if you had to um, equate this fish with like um, Godzilla being a very aggressive fish, um, uh, uh, Clifford the Big, big Red Dog being docile and King Kong in the middle, I would say it's more like King Kong. It's a big burly fish that really just wants to be left alone, but if you press him, he will handle business. Jack Dempsey cichlids um, don't need super, super big, big tanks because they only get about... <laughs> I almost said a cuss word. They only get about eight inches long, give or take an inch or two. Um, so a 55 would do them just right. Male Jack Dempsey cichlids get a little bit larger than the females and stockier body. And their top fin, their dorsal fin, gets a long, long, stringy um, trail at the end of it. Kind of like a shoestring. Whereas the female's dorsal fin um, comes to just a, a, a smooth, roundish curve. Not round like a ball, but it's not, it's not pointy and long. The male Jack Dempsey cichlid also color is a little bit more brighter, um, whereas the females may not have as much blue. Now, some people say that the male Jack Dempsey, um, the blue kind of just stops about right here, where in the female, that it travels a little bit more further down behind its gills um, underneath its, its jaw. But here's the problem. Jack Dempsey's have been bred for coloration for so long that sometimes the male's blue are, is all over. So they're small, it's almost impossible to tell. So if you plan on getting a breeding pair, the best thing to do is to get multiples. Breeding is the only issue that you will really have a problem with. Um, male Jack Dempsey's will become very, very territorial when there's a female around. So they might fight other males. If there's a tank with just males in it, I have never really seen it to be a problem. But I'm not saying that's always true in every case. In most cases, male Jack Dempsey's get along. When you drop a female in there, now you got breeding. Now you got territory issues and um, somebody got to go. They're not picky eaters. They'll eat pretty much anything you put in the tank. When they're small, you give them flakes. When they're larger, you want to give them a, a cichlid pellet that floats. If not, they'll go ahead and grab it off the bottom. They're not picky eaters. You're not going to have an issue there. You're going to want to keep the temperature at around 80 degrees. That's the way they like it. That's the way that they'll be more active at that temperature. There is a parameter for pH, but I'm going to be honest with you, I'm not going to give it to you because Jack Dempsey cichlids have been captive bred for so long, they pretty much could tolerate any pH. You can put them with a wide range of fish. I've had them with angels myself, um, but you can put them with fire mouths, convicts, any um, semi-aggressive to aggressive um, fish it would be a good tank mate. You have more of an issue with the other fish trying to fight the Jack Dempsey than the Jack Dempsey trying to fight the other fish, in my opinion. That's just my, that's just me, that's just me. Uh, regular Jack Dempsey, while they're small, nothing, nothing, to, um, nothing to, to look twice at, but as they get older, a male or female regular Jack Dempsey is an impressive aquarium um, addition in anyone's tank. So there it is, a quick little overview on the Jack Dempsey cichlid according to Aquafunk. If you have a fish that you would like me to do a three minute or less video, please put it in the comments below. If you've never seen my channel before, I invite you to hit the subscribe button, notification bell, and if you like this video, leave a thumbs up. I do plan on doing more of these three minutes or less because you're busy, you're on the go, you ain't got time for a 30 minute video, and I don't either. 